So I bought this charboy broil grill about 10 years ago and initially I really liked it. It worked well and then several years ago the igniter quit working and I didn't use it as much because I also have a smoker and I also thought that it would be extremely hard to replace the igniter thinking that the entire mechanism had to be removed. So I went online and looked at a number of videos that talked about how to replace the igniter and also noticed that several of them talked about replacing the battery, which was part of the igniter. For the life of me, I couldn't figure out where the battery was on this particular igniter. As you can see, there's really nothing that you can remove from the igniter. I did notice a number of the videos talk about replace, uh, removing several of the panels, including the doors, which was easy to do by removing those pins and then undoing the screws on the side and removing that panel that's in the way of the igniter. Just as I got done removing the igniter, I noticed that that didn't seem to have resolved my problem and I still hadn't located the battery for this particular grill. Finally, after searching a little bit more, I discovered that the battery was actually here on the side of the unit and not on the front like it was in some of the others that I had seen online. It turns out removing the battery is actually pretty easy. You just simply unscrew the black knob, take the battery out and put a new one in and make sure that you actually put it back in the way it was when you removed it because it doesn't work if you put it in backwards. After replacing that battery and the igniter, this grill is now back to normal and working just like it was the day I bought it. So thanks to those on YouTube that provided instructions, and I thought this additional information might come in handy.